welcome back to my channel cat by nagendra so let's continue with this drafting tutorials now under views we have seen about this projections and one more this section views now let's continue here with this detail views so what is meant by this detail view means just you can see this basic engineering drawing video now rs details is nothing but like let's say for example if we are having complex drawing and we need to specify only a single part dimensions here itself now here only if i give all dimensions it will get clumsy and will be not able to read drawing properly when we are having very big one bigger view why because view size will be more but the dimensions and all it will get intricate there itself so in such condition by using this detail view we are able to select a particular area and we are able to select zoom in portion of that particular area and we can specify separately now let me show you here with this detail view for example i need to take only this much part or that it should be a zoom in view now for example just i need this much i'll draw circle now just we can keep it here see so this is very small here so here only if i give dimension it will be very difficult to read but here if i specify dimensions easy to identify and easy to read the drawing properly that is about detail view so detail view is nothing but we are able to select a particular area or region in circle shape and we are able to get zoom in portion of that selected area and we are able to specify separately that is about this detail view then second option we are having here detail view profile so here directly if i go with a detail view we are able to select area only with circle shape but if we are going here with this detail view profile we are able to draw in which shape we want to select that particular area like this okay it should be a closed profile now we can keep it here if you want to increase size also as we know we can go for properties here and we can increase the size of this view now let's say for example i need this 2 is to 1 like this it will give become still more bigger like this so that is about detail view selection of area with this circle then detail view profile means we are able to draw our own profile you can see here like this then next we are having here quick detail view so quick detail view means here also we are able to select the area in circle shape similar to that then we are able to get zoom in portion of the selected area but just you can see the difference between these two whenever we are going to use this detail view we are not able to get whatever this circle shape we have drawn that we call it as boundary so we are able to get detail view without boundary but if you are going here with this quick detail view whatever the shape we have drawn here that border boundary also will be shown here like this let me show you one more also here quick detail view profile we are able to draw our own shape like this and detail view should come with that outer boundary also like this so this outer boundary also will be shown when we are going here with this quick details i hope you have understood about this details then next we can go here with this cropping views will be there like clipping views crop clipping is nothing but we can make crops now let's go back let me enter go back by using control plus z then under clippings we are having again same similar to detail views four options so just briefly i'll explain clipping view will be there it means we are able to select area with circle shape then clipping view profile means with our own shape we can draw then quick clipping view means with circle we are able to select and outer boundary circle also will be shown then quick clipping view profile means with our own shape we can draw and whatever that outer boundary we have drawn that boundary also we will get now we'll see what is meant by clipping so clipping is nothing but if we are going with the detail view selected area we will get zoom in portion and we are able to specify separately that is detail view but if you go with the clipping view whatever the part or whatever the area we are able to select and if i click here 
whatever we have selected only that part will be there remaining entire drawing will be vanished that is clipping view opposite to detail views by using this clipping view we are able to select area like this and once if i make it a closed boundary whatever we have selected only that part will be there remaining entire drawing will be vanished so that is about clipping view in very rare cases we can use then same here also quick clipping means this outer boundary will be there like this selected area with outer boundary will be present same quick detail view profile we can are able to draw with our own shape and here also outer boundary will be present that is about clipping views i hope you have understood so these are options similar to this details on detail views only i don't want to waste your time so briefly i have completed then next we are having here break views under break view first option only we are having here broken view what is mean by this broken view means let's say for example we are having one drawing sheet of a4 size now a4 size sheet we are having here like dimensions of 297 into 210 that already we know if you are having lengthy shafts and whatever the view size is there that is bigger than the size of this drawing sheet in such conditions it will become very large like length will be reduced now this bottom plate front view is there for example width we are having limited only let's say some 50 or 100 but length we are having here some 1000 or 2000 in in that way so in such condition this entire view will be not placed properly into drawing sheet so there we can create this break so this break view will be used mainly for lengthy shafts for example i'll select broken view for this view i need to make broken view either we want break view so here just if i try to select we are not able to select anything why because activated view is this one whatever we are going to do here section views detail views or clipping views it will be coming to activated views only now i need section view or broken view for this one but this is the activated view i am not able to get anything here so what we need to do first we need to activate the view by double clicking on that for which we need to generate here broken view or section view or detail view or clipping view then after making activation for example i need here broken view for this then either we want broken view with reference to horizontal direction or vertical direction maximum cases we will use vertical only i'll select vertical then from here to up to where we want break for example i need up to break here then just double click outside you can see entire this width it is reduced and it came compact but original size will be there only let me show you the dimension about this dimension again next tutorial we'll discuss for example total length is 250 even though after making this break view total length will be 250 only why it is important means that as we have discussed when we are having lengthy shafts and lengthy views it will occupy more drawing space into drawing sheet in such condition we can make it this break view it will get very compact size but original dimension will be present so that is here importance of broken view i hope you have understood about this broken view then next we are having here breakout view so what is mean by this breakout view means let's say for example i need one section view from here for that again i need to activate this double click on that i'll take section view from here like this you can see once if i make cut section view this section view is coming entire this length now what i want means i need cut section view only for this particular area only this much we want remaining all it should be normal if you go directly with section view whatever cut section of material is there entire thing we will get hatching but what i wanted is only this much we need to show hatching remaining as it is it should be there in such condition we can't get cut section at particular area by using section views 
we can go here with this breakout view now i need breakout view only for this area let me create here shape this much now automatically it will reflect into 3d viewer where you want to make cut section so we need to specify this whole shape right i will drag that plane up to this cut section like this then once if i say okay here only this area only we will get this cut section view remaining as it is it will be there so that is about this breakout view i hope you have understood about this views like breakout view and broken view so here we use only these two options this we won't use i will close this then under views toolbar last we are having here same as we have discussed in introduction class here automatically we will get front view top view or else front view bottom view and right view or else all views by using these different type of views we are able to insert single single view into drawing instead of that if i want to insert all three views at a time with reference to first angle or third angle or all views for example i need all views we will open window for example we need for this bottom plate all views will be placed into drawing at a time like this and whatever it is highlighting in red color this is the activated sketch if i move this with reference to that all views will move why because with reference to this main view only all this different type of views got projected just we can insert all views in a single click by using this wizard so usually this we call it as wizard here wizard different type of wizards will be there so this is about different type of views then again next tutorial we will continue one by one so i hope you are understanding my videos if you really like it please like the video and share it to your friends to whom it will be useful thank you so much thanks for the support